And hey guys, it's me, Tuck. Welcome back to some Mario Sports Mix. Um, in the last episode, we begin. We began. We began on Mushroom Cup. No, we do not want to start over. We want to continue from where we left off. We did Mario Stadium and Koopa Troopa Beach as the last two stages, and this time we're going to be finishing off. And we're still Toad and Bowser Jr. and all that good stuff. And after this, I think I might do a mushroom, or not a mushroom, a flower cup match, just so you know. Yet at the same time, I'm still unsure. But this time we're facing Diddy Kong and Waluigi in Peach's Castle, the final stage for Mushroom Cup. And this is one of those stages that I really like for volleyball, for the main reason of the gimmick. It's really cool, and I like this gimmick for Peach's Castle, for volleyball in general. Because it keeps, it keeps the match hectic. I'm just going to say that. And the volleyball is once again blue. I do not know... Does, if anyone knows why the volleyball is blue, yet in some stages it's white. In, for any, about anything about the colors, if anyone knows, that would be amazing if someone could tell me. Because I am in desperate need of knowing. Anyways, as you can see from those fountains that were shooting up right there, <clears throat> that is the gimmick. If the volleyball, just like the plain old volleyball, if it hits that, those little um, fountain things shooting up right there, then let me try to show this. Then it hits, it hits back, and it's back on this side. And this is a continued, continuous, a continuous. Oh my God, continuous process until you know someone finally misses. So pretty much everything that's new is the fountains, and then there's different kind of ways, like you saw it shoot up a little bit, like in groups of three it looked like, I can't really tell, but you saw it. It does that, um, sometimes, like how it is showing right here, it takes up pretty much half the court. And um, we're already ready for a special. This is a good way, like hitting the fountains, that's another way that you can use to build up your star power, or not your star pa power, your special power. Um, it's a, it's a good way, but at the same time, it can make the match really long, so I usually just play it out. And a nice shot up of Diddy's butt. Lovely. Anyways, um, there's another thing I feel like I'm missing. Oh yeah, um, items can shoot through the fountains, like if you shot a green shell, and it's headed like through a fountain, it'll go straight through it. I believe all items will go through it. That is what I'm aware of. I don't, I don't know of any that can't. And um, that's pretty much it about the fountains. Still a very cool idea, and this is one of the most uniquest volleyball nets I've ever seen in my life. Look at this. That's so freaking unique. And they missed. Nice computers. Anyways, um, getting coins... Oh, here's another one. Shh. There's like a small opening in the center. Forgot about that one, too. Anyways, coins and stuff aren't that um, plentiful in this match, so pretty much we're going to be slow pacing it. And they get all the items and stuff. Okay, I see how it is. And there's a different item, the bomb -omb. Um... I think we hit the item box. We did, but we had a green shell. Uh, I want them to use their bomb bomb. Uh, that was our fault. For real, that happened. Of course. Let's see if we can... Like, you see there, it went through the fountain. Even though you couldn't really tell, it kind of did. And I keep using that one thing that I'm not supposed to use. Oops. Well, I'll explain it later. So, yeah. It's going to be probably in this video anyways where I explain it. Uh, oh my god. Haha. -ha. You can't pass the ball. You suck. See, this is, this is what I mean by tedious, continuous... Um, match and but all the also, the effects of the bomb bomb are you are knocked out, 
if, like, say the ball is used as a bomb and then it come to comes towards you, you hit it. Let's say you have coins, you lose those coins because it takes you a long time to get back up, but you'd have just enough time to get up and hit the ball, but you lose your coins, which really sucks. So bomb bombs are like the kind of item in this portion of the game that I really want to punch in the face because it's really annoying and it causes me to lose my stuff. Alright, let's see if we can show this. We didn't because it was too close to the right. Okay, we're almost done with this, yet we're taking forever. Let's use a special. A toad special. Yeah. Look at those toad fans in the background cheering us on. They approve. Even though that blue one got hit in the face. Well, not really, because it bounced off the wall. The invisible wall that apparently is in every sports game of Mario's. That one hit the ground. Okay, Diddy? Did oh, Y'all saw that. It hit the ground. I'm taking that to my grave. And <laughs> Waluigi can't hit it. Haha. Uh -huh. Anyways, that's one set for us, and we have just one more, and then Mushroom Cup is ours, and we're probably going to unlock Moogle once again. Because that's how you unlock Moogle, just one Mushroom Cup. Very lazy way to win something. Just put it in the front Mushroom Cup. Alright. Here we go. It's going to hit the water and bounce off, and they're going to take forever. They're raising their special bar up that they're never going to use. And they're not back there, so I'm just going to do that. I forgot to mention a few other um, stages that I really like. But um, I'm not really going to mention them right now because one of them is unknown to us right now. And I don't, even though I've mentioned it before, I don't want to spoil it. So, yeah, I'll just keep the rest of the match, the stages that I like in the loof. Oop, we made that one. What the crap was that? Oh well. Anyways, um, you pretty much know that Peach's Castle and DK Docks are two of my favorite volleyball stages. I don't think I ever mentioned my favorite stages for basketball. Um, which is, of course, Bowser Jr.'s Boulevard because I like all the lottery chances and stuff. I'm a huge casino person. Even though I've never been to one in my life, I would love to go to one just to, you know, see it. So there's that. Um, another one is Ghoulish Galley, and I really like that one. Which I haven't played a volleyball stage there either. Holy crap. I've never played that much volleyball in this game, so there's some that, that I still have not seen. Let's use another Toad special because we need a we need a point. Kaboom! I'm thinking we're not going to do a Flower Cup now just because of this incredibly long match. Ruins my day. Not really, but still. Imagine if this was three player. I would be here forever. Because seriously, three three person takes that long. Third person, three people, whatever. Third person, three person, three, trace. Another word for three in another language that I'm unaware of. It's all there. Oh yeah, take that and slurp it. Holy crap! Twice in a row. Can we get it three times? No. Anyways, time to show you the red shell. Pretty much, it's... Uh, pretty much, of course I would say that. Basically, it's really fast, and it curves. It's not like your basketball, where it goes straight into the goal and just curves. It's really fast, and you have to... You have to be cautious about the, those red shells on this game. And if you try to hit it back, you, you get tossed aside. Ah, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh well. Use a special and boom. See look it burns the you see it burns the ground. 
That is hilarious. I saw that at fir the first time I saw that, I thought someone took a crap in the middle of the f um, stage, but apparently it's burnt ground, which is funny. They might as well just hand us the match, because they're not going to do any better. Seriously, we have two more points left. They haven't used their item. They have not used their special. They are sucking it up hardcore. They just need to throw in a towel, find one, or just lose this one right here. Come on, miss that one. Okay, miss that one. How about that one? Of course not. F, yeah. We just won. And I'm thinking that this is going to be another video because 11 minutes? Uh, no. I don't think so. Plus, I'd have to put like mushroom and flower cup in the video thing, and I don't think I'd have that much room, so I guess this would kind of work. And we win Peach's Castle for volleyball. Awesome. And Diddy Kong loses. Disappointment. But we won! Joy, and more joy, because we can now move on to Flower Cup. And why volleyball's color is green, I'll never know. I would think light blue. That's what I think of when I think of volleyball. Because, you know, when I think of light volley bleh. when I think of volleyball, I think of the beach. Because, you know, that's where people would play, usually volleyball. Unless there's random volleyball courts and parks or whatever, but still. And then, usually at the beach, I think of light blue, and because of the vastness of sky that you see there, so it's pretty much what pops up in my head. We're going to quit, because it's way too late to start, and we unlocked Moogle, of course. Might show Moogle, might not. We'll have to see. We'll, have, we'll see him sooner or later, or her, or it, whatever. So, this concludes Mushroom Cup Normal Mode for Volleyball. We're already at a good start, but in the next video we will be seeing the Flower Cup normal mode for volleyball, and hopefully it won't be that long and or a pain in the butt, so yeah. Thanks to you all for watching, hope you all enjoyed, and I hope to see you all in the next video.